Well, after waiting five years, we are finally headed to China. Um, we are in San Francisco. We've been on the plane five hours from Orlando. And in about 15 hours, we'll be in Beijing. On our fifth day traveling, which would be the 16th, we finally get to meet little Vienna. So we're looking forward to that. How do you expect her to react to us? Well, I'm hoping that she won't scream her head off because she doesn't know us. And I pray that she's very cuddly and would want to be held a lot. Hello and welcome to Beijing International Airport. We're here on May 13th, which happens to be our 22nd wedding anniversary. We just got off an 11 or 12 hour flight from San Francisco and we're finally here in China. We're ready to rock and roll. See you later. thoughts at this point? Well, the flight wasn't too bad, you know? It's kind of like um, 15 hours. first five hours went really good because I met someone that I talked to and had a great time. And then the other time, I kept thinking, well, it's going to be easier than when we bring the baby home. So. Good, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. I'm Valerie. Hi, Sherry. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Now you are spreading influence your family. So you can say, oh yeah, Chinese New Year, go to Chinatown. All Chinese persons wear the right color. This is the reason. Uh, you can see on the city, the roof is the yellow color. Ancient time in China, yellow color only can used by imperial families. That's the first thing you can now use yellow color. The Korean city is the construction Ming Dynasty. The year is 1406. You the 14 years finish all constructions here and finish 1420. Ming and Qing two dynasty, there are 25 emperors live inside Control China. It's a very big area, more than 3,000 rooms here. Uh, the last one, Imperial Garden. It's a very pretty garden, more than 10,000 square meters. The flower, the trees here. We had lunch here at the Jade restaurant slash jewelry place. And I think the most impressive thing is this ship. $57,000, probably well worth it. So it's, you know, I really want to clap the bull, but I have no chance. I'm so sorry for that. <laughs> I feel so sad. <laughs> okay, I will lead you to the entrance and you go clap the wall. But the one way you go remember, the thing may go up and the thing may going down. The thing may going up and the thing may going, going down. Okay, so, uh, you know, in Chinese thing, if you can clap the wall, you will be heroes. Pretty quiet up here. 45 minutes again. Looks like there's Beijing way over there. here. That's what my hand looks like from 
holding the handrail all the way down. This is what it looks like from below. Looks a little steep, but... Okay, it looks really steep. But it looks like you're done. Right about there. That's really only about two-thirds of the way. It's after five o'clock. So it's awfully quiet. Everything's closed. I missed out on the ice cream. But it's time to get back on the bus and go back to the hotel. Okay. I wish anybody, everybody here get a perfect baby and bond with you immediately. But uh, sometimes it happens, sometimes not. I wish everybody get, but I want to tell you now. Maybe make you so nervous, but I know. Now you can listen to me. When you get a, not, you get a baby cry, everything, you will not listen to your guy. So I want to tell you now, if you get a perfect baby, you forgot anything I told you now. And the first two or three days, it's very hard. It's very hard. So, uh, be patient, you know? If you need, I can help you take care of your baby. All kinds of babies I take care of, you know? I'm single available, but I'm experienced. <laughs> I can do that, it's no problem. But uh, one thing is you to take care of the baby. You need bond with the baby, you know? You know, for your whole way, whole trip in China, your guy can help you with that. How, how about your flight go by America? It's a 14 flight. 14 hour fly with a cry baby. I cannot imagine that. <laughs> now, I also have some special situation, like the uh, father's baby or mother's baby. You can open the baby, stay inside, open it, or fast care, always be taken care of by female or male. They so used to be taken care of by father or mother. And the first week, even first week, you know, the, another person cannot touch the baby. And now hold the baby. So there are some special situation happened. Be patient. You'll be patient. So and to play with your baby, give food to your baby, hold your baby, everything. Let the baby know you're a nice person. You will stay with the baby hold the time. You take care of the baby whole life. So it be uh, also so just be very patient to be that. They will be changed. You know, and at first, if you got a new environment, or because they're living a habit, they're very big difference. There is something different. No, do not sleep, do not uh, eat anything. Because this is very normal, you know. Just be patient. Then your guide can help you to take care of the baby. Here we are, five o'clock, <laughs> Sunday morning, heading to the airport. 40, how many, 43 of us, 48 of us? Something like that, 19 families. Everybody's going different places, well, especially us. So, here we are. Slept wonderfully on that very hard bed and looking forward to today. Ditto. Are you taking a picture out there? Pardon? Sun's coming up in Beijing, China. Padre says, look for your. There's Valerie waiting for our next flight to the province, which I can't yet pronounce. And we're going to be on a plane similar to that one right there. Crossing the bridge, and under this bridge is a river. It's very famous river in Chongqing. It's called the Jiali, J I A L I N G, Jiali River. And this river is a cleaner compared to one another famous river. It's called the Yangtze River. Yeah. Yeah. yeah and this river's color is cleaner okay. because it's a shorter, not so long like Yangtze River. Yeah. So the pollution is not so heavy. Today's the day we get to meet Vienna, and they pronounce her name. Suga. We think. That's what our um, guide said. 
Well, this is what our room looks like. <clears throat> and uh, as you can see, we have a welcoming corner here. It's gotcha day, I think. And uh, getting ready for that. Now, the city is called Chongqing. Chongqing. Here's Valerie looking for her camera so she can take a picture of some wedding gowns. Here's our hotel. We went across the street, risking life and limb to do so. Uh, we are on the opposite side, I think, of the hotel. There it is. This is what the street looks like across the street from the hotel. Lots of stuff going on. Oh, and here are the wedding dresses that we've heard so much about. It's 9.15 on Gotcha Day. Thank you very much. Folks are selling stuff along the street here. Some good luck charms. A lucky ox foot, or I don't know what that is. Lucky ox horns. Just uh, you know, so venture to the civil fair office and see your baby girl, yeah, your daughter, and uh, she's lovely and the cutest uh, ever. And uh, so, the, I wish you have a wonderful day today. <laughs> Will we take it's her a with us? Day. <laughs> Will we take her with us? Yeah, mm -hmm. with you. Yeah. Yes. This afterwards. <laughs> yeah. So you will be forever family. Yeah. Yes. And um, you expect her to cry probably for the first couple of days. Um, but it's up to, you know, so the girl's, uh, you know, so the character and personality. Some, uh, you know, so I even found the young babies, they smile, they're happy, they love the, everyone, the, you know, so held her very closely mm -hmm. and touch her, and it's no problem. And uh, so some kids will be a little scared. Yeah. yeah. Maybe, the, you know, so the Chinese babies, they see more the Chinese often. So the two you, they still feel a little strange. It's a yeah. different color here, the different face. Yeah. yeah. And maybe she will be more curious about you first. Sure. Then, uh, but I wish you must have the good bonding. Yeah. Yes. In very, very short time. Yeah. Good. <laughs> Good. The high rise building in our front, the first one, the first black building. Are you nervous, Valerie? Um, not really but nervous. But I feel it was a half and half. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm curious. I'm very curious what she is going to, how she's going to respond to us. But already in my mind, I'm, I'm trying to gear up for the fact that she won't want to come to us. She'll want her, her nanny before us, but that's okay. We'll just work it out. Well, I got a rattle in there, but I brought a little um, soft doll that is the exact same type that Danielle had, but it's not the same one, I don't think. Mm -hmm. And then a little book that's got a squeaky elephant. Squeaky. Yeah. It just might be exciting to her. We'll see. Okay. Interesting place.
How do you say her name? Hi. Hi. You have a little problem here? You won't let go. <laughs> Does that remind you of anybody? You let go. Good job. Want to try it again? No, only lasted about 10 seconds. Have you ever seen a white man before? I don't know. She is beautiful. This is uh, the last girl. Uh, it's a uh, you know so the same orphanage with Vega. It's just about uh, I told you the family also from the Florida. Oh. Yeah, and about uh, maybe three months old, younger than Gaga. Yeah. Oh, sure. And this is uh, her mama emailed me photo, so oh. I print out the photo for her. Oh. Oh. Take her some photo. Yeah, you can email me, so I, I can print that. out the same thing like this. Um, okay. she's our biological, biological. and then we um, when she was. Four. Mm -hmm. We got Alexander, she was oh, three. Yes, three. Okay. And then two years later, we got her, and she was 13. Uh-huh. Oh, oh. 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 So for the, you know, so her the sleeping, yeah. Ready? Quiet.
I wonder if that's going to change. You're sure quiet. You're just adorable right now, aren't you? Can I have a kiss? Can I have a kiss? Oh, you're so sweet. That's pretty good. I think it's only been an hour and a half since I met you. And you're such a sweetheart. Yes, you are. You're such a sweetheart. <laughs> oh, goodness sakes. Who wouldn't just love you? Hmm? Who wouldn't just love you? Right? While I need. While I need. Good, good. Yes, you are. You are. Well, I mean. Vienna is enjoying her rice. It's, I put it in some broth, chicken broth. It was chicken and bamboo shoot. But we just got the broth and the, and the rice, and she's loving it. And I forgot the baby spoons up in the hotel room, so we're just going to make do. And the Japanese restaurant has many, many strange you and like that, interesting too? dishes. The most interesting I found was the casserole rabbit head. They have a little bit of everything for every Asian taste. Mm -hmm. The stir fry is fantastic. You pick your own meat and vegetables and they kind of do it up there and then let you. You're done. It's very, very good. Okay. Mm hmm. And where did mommy go? Well, see, I tried, but I couldn't get the TV to work. Do you know what I mean? Well, I tried that, but the remote just doesn't work. I suppose I could try unplugging it and turn and plugging it back in again. What do you think? Should I try it? I should try it? Even though Mommy's in the other room? All right, here it goes. Ooh, it smells good, doesn't it? She slept from 10 o'clock until 7. Wow. Let's see. Let's see. Come on. Thank you, girl. What a good girl. You slept so nice. But, yes, you did. We're going to have a fun day today. You feel all nice and clean this morning. Mm, we're going to have a good day, aren't we? Are we going to have a good day? Huh? You bet. Another foggy day in Chungqing.
very typical day for this place, I guess. Still 23 floors up. Good morning. People here checking out the weather, checking out the day. We have a new little girl who's enjoying a new day. She's drinking what? What's in there? Formula and rice cereal combined. Sweet. That's how they told us to make it. Cute you are. You're so cute today. Yes, you are. You're all ready to play. Vienna, where's Mama? That's better. But how is Mama going to get ready? You guys get this turn. It fell off. It's not going to go down. I gave the photo to the orphanage lady okay. and he's from this family. Oh, and, oh but, yes. But this family's girl uh -huh. and is also the, the same cat the, with this family meeting their parents. Oh. The girl, is uh, I remember, is also a... a Two three months younger than her, uh -huh, yeah. Because uh -huh. both of them are born the 2010, right? Yeah, 2010. Right. Yeah. Yeah. The later for the American, the immigration visa use. So you need the, the mommy, daddy, and write the, both of your information on this page. Good little nap. We'll put you in a different outfit. Okay. Today we're going to make it official. At least according to the Chinese. So, Ben has to wear something really fancy for the photograph. First day in the stroller. 
How's it going? Good. Work, no more paper. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Going to Pizza Hut. Pushing a baby. Should I hold Not it? very happy right now. Should I hold it? Go ahead. Time with pizza. Good. Are you enjoying your trip to the park so far? Good. Let's take a look around. Chin Ching. Sophie said all these high rises are here just since 2000. I wonder if the smog has been here just since 2002. Lots of apartments for millions and millions of people in this one city. Chinese monument. And flower. Flower. And the sun and the sun. And the bird. Bird. And two birds. And ship. And two ship. That is very amazing. And the good fish. Okay. If you want to sample, it's only for one word, it's okay. H A O. How? 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 <laughs> yeah. And this is very good. It's a
march is in the front. This is Old Town, Chongqing, Narrow Street, blocks in the street were laid here a thousand years ago, or so Sophie tells us. Dresses. Paparazzi. She wears The first paparazzi. Oh, 
Too many steps to go up into the temple. And opera this side, that is our city museum, oh. Chongqing's museum. Okay. And uh, we can spend some time in the museum so you can know more about uh, you know, the Chongqing. And maybe there's a uh, small part for her hometown, Xiu San. Very famous building in this town. People Assembly Hall. Feel you like a Beijing Temple of the Heaven. Yeah. And it's Vienna's nap time. I left and arrived their hotel before. I left and arrived the museum. We used to go to the museum. Here's the museum that we're going to go into. Lots of construction, Chongqing. Ten million people in the main part of the city, 33 million in all of the cities combined in this area. We have two museums in one building. A couple of video guys here at the museum today. And their painting, painting exhibition, oh, and sure. some very famous artists that we did you know, exhibition here, you buy uh, one more ticket. Okay. <laughs> But that's it's up to you, yeah. <laughs> but bigger part is a thing. Uh, this one we call the sedan and it's working for the you know the old tense rich people and local family and their boy will going to get married. So the daddy will hire this one like today's BMW or the Mercedes carry the beautiful girl back to the boy's home. Yeah. <laughs> Like a home, home government. This is only 
Supplements is a big speaker and nice. This is the Chinese Shakespeare. He has an interesting story. Chu Yuan. And he committed suicide by jumping into a river right before the officials were coming to get him because he was against corruption and they never found his body. So every June, the uh, people of the area make dumplings and stuff and throw it in the river and to feed the fish so that they won't eat the body of their favorite poet, author guy. I think she might be missing some of this. So. And that is the son of our country's minority rich people stand to. But not all of them, because total number we have a 55. And they're just the son of them. But the island's hometown, just like I said, there are so many the people called Miao. Miao people, is that the sample from that pink girl? She wears a pink hat. That is a Miao people's character. They always wear like that. Yeah. Very fond of the embroidery on their dress. Yeah. Total of 56 minority groups in all of China, and we believe that Vienna came from the Miao people, and that group is represented by this woman here. Yeah. The Tuja people, Tuja people and Miao people right. are very similar. Yeah. And About come the from 52 the percent of the Shusan County. The people are from Tuja or from Miao. So only the 48 percent people live from us, from Han people. Yeah. In here in the middle one, and this is also a Miao's girl. And uh, in, you know, the, in Miao, the minority race area, the people only speak their own language, the language called Miao's language. They are very like the silver. So you can see this girl wear too much silver jewelry from his head to his toe. Yes, here it is, the one you've been waiting for. The Ming vase. Or vase, depending on where you're from. The Ming dynasty was the second to the last dynasty in China. And these guys have nothing to do with that. She is cleaning up. Good job. Uh, still sleeping. Yeah. The lady said. She'll wake up now. Yeah. Because we're going to the airport. And what's going in across the street? Another apartment building by chance? Colonel is very popular here. Looks like a traffic jam on the bridge. Friday. Everybody uh, hurry to go home. Yeah, rock shower will be earlier than Monday to Thursday. Yes, yeah, so no work on Saturday and Sunday. Yeah. yeah Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Dry season right now, the water is very low in the river. I think that was Jackie Chan.
first airplane ride. Thank goodness it's only a couple hours or less. Thank goodness we brought potato chips, sour cream and onion. Oh. Here in Guangzhou at the fabulous White Swan Hotel. The white swan. We just borrowed a uh, stroller from this joint. Borrowed. They wouldn't take any money. And the rest of the area looks, I don't know, a bit European to me. And Kelly's given us the lowdown on laundry service, etc., etc. First medical exam, at least the one that we're with. They checked her hearing, her sight, her ears. Oh, I don't know if they checked her sight. Um, her measurements, her weight, all that kind of stuff. Yeah. And you were a good girl, weren't you? Heading out on a tour. We don't know where yet. Happy now with the bottle. She's been a good girl after the medical exam, which was just a check her over kind of deal. And also on this island, it is a very, uh, very nice school. Very nice the school. Uh, like my niece, she's in the school is is here. So that's the most they call the best uh, school here, but it's very stressful for the children. So I don't think I will send my daughter to that school. It's too stressful. Is it private or public? It's public in China. In China, it's very different with uh, states. It's uh, this like hospital, school, college. The best one in China for this is still the belongs to the government. Somebody fell asleep on the bus. They missed the tour. Oh well. It's kind of like downtown Guangzhou. This building here is like a World Trade Center type of building, 103 stories tall. That goofy looking one is the opera, of course. The stadium was built for the Asian Games that happen every four years. On the years the Olympics are not going on, it's just for Asian countries to participate and again our TV tower is the tallest one in the world.
Guangzhou Opera House. <laughs> Take my juice bottle for me, I'll have to get you good. <laughs> Hoppa hoppa rider, so riding line and mention and see this the rocks and ride and see some sacks and then the barns was the felt mark done. Ooh, read the dinner. Should we do patty cake? Patty cake, patty cake, baker's men. Bake me a cake as fast as you can. Roll it and pat it and mark it with a B. Put it in the oven for Vienna and me. Patty cake? Can you do patty cake? I think I came to the wrong place. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. And I do, I want to get to the right church. Because this one is closed until June. And today is May 22nd, the day after Doomsday. And I'm looking for a church. I heard there was one in this neighborhood. I thought this was it. Our guide explained that in this part of Guangzhou, during the uh, Opium Wars 150 years ago, the English and the French built some buildings here in this part of town. So for a number of blocks, we see homes and apartments and so on that are of a European style. Little renovation going on in one of them. They even have a running track outside here of the, of the parallel bars outside the uh, Customs Hotel. Maybe we'll stay there next time we're in Guangzhou. Chinese believe in staying fit. When they're parks, they provide exercising opportunities galore.
I'll let you come up with your own caption. Here at the hotel, there's lots of little shops that will sell you every type of Chinese art and decor and so on that you can possibly imagine. Jade is a big deal here. Well, we also have the Swan Room. This is for the little ones. Let's go take a look. I guess this is the bull in the china shop. Everybody's getting married today in the same place. Yeah, it's a little warm, a little humid here in Guangzhou, China, like it is every day in Guangzhou, China. Let's just do a quick 360 to catch an idea of our surroundings. And a little river, a little uh, street, and all kinds of other things. Thank you so much. Sam's Club. Just a lawn ornament. I think it's the real deal. 
time for a siesta. the garden they want to make sure you know exactly what year it is and that's where we're going yeah I was thinking yeah it's not yeah, Easter but definitely <laughs> Kelly oh. Vienna what do you think of all that Looking at the baby. I think we should put our shoes on. He teaches children in an orphanage. Yeah, the ECHO is our group. ECHO means education for children's orphans. Uh -huh. The ECHO is the You and A started it? Yeah, right. Oh. We're using the, uh, the art. Okay. Yeah, to help you for the special needs orphans in China. Mm -hmm. Now in China, we have for three about this vocational school. We build this a school. Okay. Yeah, all these kids are disabled orphans. Oh. Yeah, we're hiding the special teachers to go to there to right. teach them something and help them. You see, we've got a lot of things. Oh. This yeah. to help them. Help them. Yes, yeah. give them love to change in the better future. Yeah. Here again is the city of Monzhou. It's the only place in China we've seen so far that actually has a parking lot. Otherwise, all the buildings are built with basically no parking available. Yesterday, I uh, went across the freeway. You can kind of see the freeway. Poking through there. 
And I went beyond that wall and got into a real neighborhood. It was very interesting, but I didn't feel comfortable taking much video because so many people were staring at me. But it was very dark and poor and kind of represents the real China, I think. Here's the magic uh, folder that's got all of the stuff we need to make this official so we can go home. Yay! Yay! Uh, so later in the consulate, I think um, you will be all meet in the same waiting hall, okay? And your consular will hold a group oath first. So families, you just repeat, I think you just repeat after her, such as the information I provided for this adoption are all true to the best of my knowledge. That's it, you know. Here we are at the U.S. consulate. Are you excited, Vienna? Yes, hey, Daddy. She has the hiccups right now. You become an American citizen through all this. And here's the building. It's actually inside a mall. No sign. Oh, well. Watering his tomatoes, maybe? And what about these guys over here? see the camera, don't you? You've been wanting to do that for a week. You can do it. You can do it. Come to mommy. Hey! Okay, time to go to daddy. Still at it. Oh, we should put her shoes on.
baby breakfast at the White Swan Hotel. Babies everywhere you look. Including right here. And today we're eating rice kanji with a little bit of uh, sugar. I think she likes it. There, look. Just like in this is considered a semi-high-speed train. Going from Guangzhou to Hong Kong. planes back to America tomorrow morning. They called it the baby bus. <laughs> She had some sympathy cries just a minute ago, too, and I'm not sure she's done. Oh, but it's getting late, and they're so tired. Aren't you? Somebody's happy to be off that silly train and into a hotel room, into a new crib. Nice place they give us here. Right? But it's bedtime. And then we're gonna get on a plane tomorrow morning, fly to San Francisco, and then on to Orlando. Long day. Long day. We got really messy dirty. So today we're going to be nice and clean, fresh for our airplane ride, right?
Or we can be fresh. Here's just a little bit of Hong Kong, a little corner of it, I think. From our hotel room window. And lots of water. Here's our plane. Did you get a new toy already? First day in your new digs and then you get a new toy. Oh my goodness, and what's that? New toys? Man, you're going to go nuts! That's fantastic. So, what's the verdict? Does she like your new room? I think she does. Deanna, you like your new room? Yeah, and the toys especially, right? Here's your crib. There's the crib. And this is a bed. This is a, not her bed just yet. And there's that thing full of too many toys. And a bookcase over there. Okay, signing off. First day at home. Bye-bye.